understand me, but he drove. I wish God could come down, give me a hold. Here drove. we go! Okay. What's up with y'all, man? I'm back with another video, and today we got Thug Loving by Ja Rule and motherfucking Bobby Brown. Now, this video right here is damn near legendary for the, the way Bobby Brown acting and the way, you know what I'm saying, that the motherfucking drugs hitting his ass, the way his jaw and shit moving and shit. You know what I'm saying? Now, I haven't seen it, but they keep showing me clips of this music video on Facebook, Instagram. Every time I open the social media, they keep throwing this shit in my face. And I'm a reactor, bro. What do I look like not reacting to some shit that I actually find funny? I know that everybody on this channel, like, you know what I'm saying, Juice World Peep, and you know what I'm saying, this is real different from my channel. But, bro, I love Bobby Brown, bro. That nigga's a classic. He's a he's a real G, you know what I'm saying? We got some clips that should show y'all a little bit about who Bobby Brown is and who he was and how funny he was, you know what I'm saying? His acting skills and shit. We got some Bobby Brown, bro. We love Bobby Brown clips besides that music video. So we're going to get into that, you know what I'm saying? I ain't going to talk y'all head off. I do thank everybody for the birthday wishes. That shit felt amazing. I had no idea I was going to get that many um, wishes, you know what I'm saying? Get that many people telling me happy birthday and that many people actually giving a fuck. Never have I ever in my entire life, entire 23 years, have I ever had that many birthdays, you know what I'm saying? Had that many uh, happy birthdays, you know what I'm saying? That many people actually coming to me and, and saying something, saying even extra shit, you know what I'm saying? Bro, I hope you doing good. I hope to see you doing these videos and keep going, keep pushing. You know what I'm saying? They just saying motivated shit. And all that shit feel great because I wasn't getting that shit, none of that shit before. Such as last year, I wasn't getting that type of shit. So it's crazy how life and shit can just change that much. And it just shows you how many people actually give a fuck about you out there. Even if you feeling like there ain't nobody out there, give a fuck. That shit just showed me. But yeah, man, we finna hit the bong for the haters and um, be a little Bobby. You know what I'm saying? Let's get it. Get to this Bobby Brown, man. You know, he lost a, a daughter, I believe, and a wife. You know what I'm saying? So let's get into this shit. Let's see what comes to Bobby. Two, one. I'm not a fair, 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 I'm not a Debo, Trace, uh, Tracy Morgan, good ass movie, man. Now this one right here is a little interview of this nigga. He wasn't having that shit, bro. The type of shit they was trying to pull on, bro. Bro wasn't having it. You for the see right here. You know what I'm saying? Y'all gonna check this shit out? Y'all ready? Let's get three, two, one, go. They told me it was gonna be like a prison. How do I measure up to your cellmates? Ah, uh, you're, you're dangerous. I haven't tried any sex moves yet. What the fuck you mean, sex moves? What? Do, do I look? Uh, <laughs> you're, you're dangerous. I haven't tried any sex moves yet. What the fuck you mean, sex moves? Do, do I look like... Uh, brother. <coughs> I, I, you know, you're saying you haven't even tried any sex moves yet. Are you... <laughs> are you... Am I gay? <laughs> Bro, why does he look like... Is it Jim? From the office? Why the fuck he look like bro from the office, bro? Like identical to bro from the office. Bro, is that him? And he acting like him. He acting like him when he talked to Dwight and shit. You know what I'm saying? Bro, that's Jim, bro, from the office. I don't give a fuck. They told me it was going to be like a prison. How do I measure up to your cellmates? Uh, you're, you're dangerous. I haven't tried any sex moves yet. What the fuck you mean, sex moves? <laughs> do, do I look like... Uh, brother... I, I, you know, you're saying you haven't even tried any sex moves yet. Yeah. Are you, are you? Am I gay? Yeah. Would it make a difference? Are you? Why would it make a difference? You said to me, <laughs> I haven't even tried any sex moves on you yet. 
yet. What the fuck you mean yet? I'm a grown ass <laughs> man. Look at bro face. And this is what I mean. Like, all right. Some of this shit, and not to be, you know what I'm saying, racial and none of that shit. But a lot of that. Nah, I can't even say that because niggas in the locker room be on that gay shit. But for a lot of old school motherfuckers, that gay shit, that gay jokes and shit, you know what I'm saying? They wasn't playing that shit, bro. That shit comes as you, that shit fucks with you as a man. Like, that's coming at your masculinity as a man and what you stand for as a man. So certain jokes and shit to certain people, that shit not funny. Like a new generation, this generation now, they got a lot of gay jokes. You got Aiden Ross sitting on niggas' laps and shit. Speed bouncing his ass, but that shit is not it, bro. Like sitting on niggas' laps, people will really kill you over that. They take that shit serious. They don't. Some people don't play that shit, and it's a dangerous and it's a it's a real touchy subject because if you don't like allow, if you show show a certain type of dislike to somebody sitting on your lap and playing a joke, and you go off, bro, get that gay shit up off me, bro. That fact. If you say all that shit. You're canceled now, you know what I'm saying? But back then, bro, you gotta understand, you can't be you can't be playing with certain people like that because you will end their whole career. You will end their whole career, bro, because they can't they can't openly say certain shit on online. They can't openly say certain shit. Really how they feel. And they've been trying to, you know what I'm saying, stay away from certain things, situations, so they don't have to openly say how they actually feel. But when a motherfucker talk to you like this, and now you like, hold up, bro. I don't play that type shit, my nigga. And now everybody like, oh shit, you hate the, you know, nah, bro, it ain't even like that. They just respect me, I respect you, you know what I'm saying? I ain't just disrespecting the fact that you gay, but understand that I'm a straight man and I ain't with that. That's all that is. You know what I'm saying? I haven't I'm even eight. tried any sex moves yet. Are you, are you? Am I gay? Yeah. Would it make a difference? Are you? Why would it make a difference? You said to me, I haven't even tried any sex moves on you yet. Yet? What the fuck you yet. mean yet? I'm a grown ass man. Yet? Bro, not saying nothing, bro. He's not saying nothing, bro. I'm just making it worse. This man. He's not saying nothing. He's just staring at you. What you mean, yet? bro? <laughs> on live TV, I will fuck you up. Trust me. I, I only meant it as a joke. Okay, well, you should have laughed afterwards. Because I didn't laugh. He, he didn't laugh afterwards either, bro. Like, it's funny, though, because this shit remind me of, like, fucking that nigga from the office. It's dead ass how he be. And that nigga didn't laugh. It's funny, like, certain people got different types of sense of humor. This shit definitely funny. But to Bobby, that shit was not funny, bro. This man. Yet? Interview took a turn for the worse. <laughs> On live TV, I will fuck you up. Trust me. I, did, I only meant it as a joke. Okay, well, you should have laughed afterwards. Because I didn't laugh. I, it's like, like the, the, the conversation went, um, I said to you, what, do, do you think I'm a, an okay cellmate compared with the guys in prison? And you said, I think you're dangerous. And I said, and I haven't even tried any sex moves yet. Uh -huh. it, was, it was just a joke. Can you answer the question, though? I'm just interested. Are you? Would it matter to you if I was? You said you haven't even tried any sex Bobby moves on me past. yet. Do you know how I'll fuck you up in here? Do you know that? Well, don't, I mean, don't you disrespect me by suggesting that... Suggesting that what? Suggesting that my answer might, in some way... Make me less of a man in your eyes. I think you're less of a man for not answering. I think it's like a joke <laughs> It was just a joke, you know, it'd be more of a joke You know, it would really be more of a joke <laughs> If the 24 hours ended right now You understand <laughs> That would be more of a joke Damn, buddy Bobby gonna hurt that nigga. <laughs> Bobby gonna hurt that nigga, bruh. That's a little, a little shit about Bobby, bruh. In case you don't know some shit about Bobby, that's just some little fucking clips that I like about Bobby, bro. And we about to get into the song, bro. But this shit's so long right now that we gonna have this be its own fucking video. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man, I'm out. Okay.